Hello and welcome back once again, YouTube, to some more Sakoda playthroughs. We're finally moving on to another character. We're getting into some Chapter 2 now. So, we're going to be queuing up Hugo here, our uh, Wonder Boy from Beyond. I lost my mouse. Come back, mouse. What is happening? Anywho, let's uh, go on to his chapter two. And here we are with these guys. Uh, shall we head to Duck Village with them, I suppose? Wild Boar first. Nice, nice. Very nice attacks. Ooh. We got a fair amount of SP on the board to be used. Oh, right, we were also excited because he got his continual attack. So he can just, like, just chop people up to bits. Or enemies, rather. Sergeant Joe. So what goods do we have on us that were... Oh, he has a whole lot. Things that kind of need to be put away. Anyways, let's continue. Jeez. Just all the enemies are out to play here. I haven't been back in ages. Wilder, Sergeant, Sergeant, with fortuitous timing, we need your help at once. Brett, nothing seems to please her. We're at a total loss. We need you, Sergeant. Hmm? I've just arrived and already duty calls. Please, you're our best hope. No time for delays. Come quickly. All right, duck boys. Ah, yes. Lily, I'll ask once more, but don't make me ask again. Where is the flame champion? Will one of you answer me? How should we know? 
You must know something, yet for some reason you refuse to tell. Why are you doing this? We can't tell what we don't know. You just won't cooperate, will you? Uh -huh. Who is this flame champion? Do you know, Sergeant? Humph. <laughs> the things they don't teach kids these days. Oh, look. He's not a duck. Thank goodness. We got some sort of duckus here? Let me pass. I've had enough of you bird brains. Jeez. I thought there were only ducks here. I'm glad I was wrong. You are? Who's asking? Tell us who you are. Me? I am Lily Pendragon, daughter of Gustav, president of the Republic of Tinto. Now, your turn. Your name? I am Hugo, son of Lucia, chief of the Crying Clan. Crying Clan? I never heard of it. Anyway, Hugo, I have questions for you. Tell me what you know of the. Read. Milady, we've attained lodging. Just when I was getting somewhere. My lady, thank you for your patience. Your things are in your room. Samus. However, late milady, you may not be keen on the bed size or how close the water is. Our options are limited here. Hmm? You think me overly demanding need I remind you that you asked what I wanted and I answered right you two fine let's see which way is it this way this way ah this way milady wait who or what was that Okay, uh, there only be magic tutors here. Um, hmm. Sergeants, yeah, wind magic is crazy. What else we can really do here? So let's, yeah, go see see what's up with this Lily character. Was there nothing better? This room is too damp. Please understand, milady. Please. Are you still busy complaining? Oh, you. What is it? Uh, you want to finish that talk of ours? Okay. Fine then. Might as well speak here, where we have some privacy. Outside, you were anxious to talk. Did you say something to me? Wow. Why are we at the back door? Milady, this building is not our lodging. Ours is farther removed. Is that not more acceptable? How far removed? As far as the servants' quarters? How imaginative of you to think I would prefer such accommodations. Now then, what do you want to discuss? You wanted to talk about the Flame Champion. I most certainly do. 
If you know of the Flame Champion's whereabouts, you'll receive just compensation. The Flame Champion? The hero our grandfather spoke of? Didn't expect such a topic from the likes of you. Yes, I speak of the Flame Champion, and of the Firebringer he, le he led. They are very much alive, it seems. Or so my information tells me. I traveled all the way from Tinto to this odd place you call home to find out more. Still alive, the Flame Champion? But your mathematics have surely failed you. Who is the Flame Champion? Hmm. Oh, that's right. Few your age would know. The Flame Champion is a hero from over 50 years ago who smashed the Harmonian forces invading Grassland at that time. Harmonian forces? Yes, he led the Firebringer against the enemy. Our clan was the first Grassland clan to become allies of the Firebringer. Sounds to me like a real hero, even a great hero. He truly was. Then, after the Harmonian War, he vanished without a trace. This was all so long ago. If he were still alive today, he wouldn't look like much of a warrior. Ha! Huh. So you may think, I believe differently. Why is that? It all started when bandits attacked one of our caravans. One of those bandits turned out to be none other than one of the Firebringer. The traitors who were robbed returned to Tinto, speaking of how one of the bandits resembled the Flame Champion. Over and over, our caravans fell prey to these thieves. Eventually, we learned that the leader of those bandits was called Flame Champion by his own men, and that is obviously my motivation for coming here. Excuse me, milady. I still don't understand why we made this long journey to this place. That's right. Your personal adventures will land you in trouble with our authorities again. Don't you get it? Every Tinto merchant is fed up with those cow cowards. You have to know how to handle them. What cowards? Moving right along, since no further information can be had here, I've decided to go to the Lizard Clan. I've heard of attacks there too, but Reen Samus are useless at navigating Grassland. It took them ages just to get us here. So, how would you like to guide me to the Lizard Clan? Naturally, I'm prepared to pay for your time. About 4,000 potch? How about it, Sergeant? Well... I can't see how staying here does anyone any good. If attacks have spread to the Lizard Clan, we may as well investigate. Alright. Very good. Now, let's work out the details. First this place, now we're off to Lizard Land. Grumble all you like, but this is our job. I assume you know of Lizard Clan's travel routes? They use underground passes stretching who knows how far. That method of travel has long been one of their biggest strengths. Our scouts concur. A major junction in the network seems to be a point under the western ruins. Take me there. Then introduce me to the Lizard Clan upon tra in arrival. I'll give you 2,000 plus now, plus 2,000 when we reach Lizard Clan safely. Agreed? Agreed. These attacks involving the Lizard Clan could well be related to what we know. Now that our plans are settled, prepare to depart. Huh? Milady! We've done nothing but hurry about for days, then scurry about like ants after arriving. Maybe we not stop for a night to rest properly? Are you a man or a mouse? You were taught to strike while the iron is hot, correct? Well, weren't you? Let us do as she wants, Samus. It is simpler that way. Hmm? Ruby Reed and Samus Eldred. Ooh, they're higher level. Um. Do this. They can chill together, potentially? Hmm. Sure. We'll revise as we go. We'll leave immediately. Do you know where you're going? How should I know? That's, that is why I hired you. 
Hope she was an only child. Let's check out Lily and Crew's stuff. Okay, parry, repel, accuracy, sword magic. Repel, accuracy, damage, armor protect, and wind magic. She has a sword of rage. He can do wind stuff. Items on them are as such. Ooh, he has some shortcake and ice cream. Status is. Well, they can all definitely do some damage. She's still here. Definitely as Hugo, we cannot recruit anybody right now. No, Hugo. Made it. I'm worried about you. What does Hugo have for trade goods right now? Nothing. Well, while we're on the way to places, we can maybe make some moolah. Check out Magic Tutors. Ah, Rhett and Wilder, what's up? Not much is up with you two clowns. Okay, uh, Tutors down here. They have their best on? Hmm. She does better with some other stuff. Read. Mm, he's okay. And he apparently has his worst available one on. So be it. Okay, anything we can take. Eh, rumors. Why to sell a corker stores now? Brass Castle not going to be really available to us. Ancient Highway? That's the Great Hall. Hmm. Maybe let's make a quick trip to Brass Castle if we can. Yeah, just because there we can also do some training on peeps. Who do have some skills? Skill pointage to unload. Oh, I forgot to check out what the actual Tinto formation does. Nicely done, everybody. Probably in the next battle here, we'll see what to do.
Okay. Her. Damage fell. Beaten Samus and Balance. Lily Berserk. Ooh, interesting. Basically, sacrifice the boys for one extra turn, and then Lily gets really angry. Good. Ooh, uh, dark hair. It's already over. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of luck for the guys. We still don't. Well, we do have access to there. Ooh. If we had access to like a warehouse, I mean that'd be great for Hugo, because then we could go explore in there and dump stuff off. But we'll keep going. Maybe within this chapter we might get access to uh, Buddha Hug. Okay. Ooh, we have an ancient text here on hand. Cool. We can find that so we can go throw it in Vina Della Vizexi. Uh as well. Prices were high for salt and Vina, so maybe we will run there quick. Make some money there and level up weapons potentially. We'll see if we can even get into uh, Fortress for some training. Same time, also, we have some. Uh, Potential fortune upgrades we can do, yeah. Ooh, from Prajuri to Rati Prajuri. Also, yeah, I guess we're gonna hold on to those trade goods. At least by the time we get to um, the hollows, we will be um, able to access a combat trainer there. Eh, too many medicine bees again. Let's 
stuff, but he can't really equip anything else. Dang it, Reed! If he could just not be poisoned, that'd be so much better, you know? before we descend. A little hairy boy here. More level ups, which is all good. I should have just hit auto. It's all done. Okay, uh, actually, let's just jump right in. Actually, no, let's grab one antitoxin quick. Item shop it over here. Skills people are ever mocking. Oh, he is chanting. Or 
jungler room. Interesting. I believe these are the runes you spoke of. Nowhere else fits the description. I can't promise you'll find what you seek. Not to worry. The Tinto Scouts must be right. Leave it to me. Not here. Milady. Milady. Are you certain about this? Impersonating statues, are you? How about earning your keep? We didn't want to interrupt you. Here we come, milady. Hugo, what do you make of them? They don't act like enemies, but I'm not sure of their plans. Whack, whack, whack. Of course they're not our enemies, but does it serve us to make them allies? I told you. Sergeant, Hugo. She she found it. At least we had a few moments of rest. All right, we're rested. Let's move on. Okay, now we press left a bunch. Ooh, tarot, tarot night. Teleported. Well, they have at least very low HP pools. But we still got crazy level ups off of them? That's okay. <laughs> Easy to kill with great rewards. again. I 
quite as crazy level ups as what we got from the Terror Knights, but pretty good. Passage widens here ahead. Someone else is here. Shh. Stay down. We might learn something. Masked man. So the protection cannot be overcome. Woman. Thanks to Sindar's ancient technique, or shall we call it their magic, most impressive. Man in black, don't give up, even if you risk destroying it. What do you make of that? <laughs> they don't look like allies. Can't you see they're evil? <laughs> Lady. I believe it was you who said to keep silent. I know what I said. What makes you think they're evil? That masked man, he's definitely hiding something. And just look at that other one, all in black. What about him? His face looks untrustworthy. Let's not be hasty, says the man in coat. We have plenty of other things to do in the meantime. This shouldn't be taking so long. Let's just take what we need and go. <clears throat> that will get us nothing but chaos. That is not what we want. Chaos would suit me just fine. Hmm? Sarah, what's the matter? Nothing. That was close. We were almost discovered. Might that be because you keep yapping? What did you say to me? Why don't we just decide what we're going to do? We can't hide here forever. He's right. What's the best way? Answer is obvious. Hmm? Frontal assault. Yeah, of course. Hold on now. I don't know anything about them. I'm with the boy. We already know what we need to know about them. We do? That they're evil. Hasn't anyone been listening to me? Let's go, Hugo. Right. Stop! How dare you leave in the middle of a conversation? <laughs> we shouldn't push our luck. It could result in diminishing returns. Who would have thought it would take this long? Very well, then. What was that? What are you doing? You don't look like simple travelers. You're not from the grasslands, are you? I doubt if you are either. Your little band looks out of place here, too. You are Lily Pendragon, daughter of the Tinto Republic president. How would you know that? The honor is all mine. Pity you don't have the time to get acquainted.
you saw long enough, say goodbye. I am ready. I'd like to add another element of style to our exit. It won't take but a moment. See that it doesn't. But of course. Stop right there. I'll stop after I finish you. Alrighty. Even though I think. Ha oh, ha ha! Yeah. The man in black is, uh. kind of a dangerous beast. Jeez, good dodge. Yes. Oh. This might do some serial damage. Not down yet. Sure, let's do it. It's dumb. There it is. <laughs> it's a scripted, scripted loss. Ho oh, hum. This is boring me. It's not like you're even a challenge. Ha ha ha. Worry not, young one. I'll put you out of your misery. Your timing is regrettable. Come now.
they were too strong for us. What did you expect? They're evil. I've never known evil to be weak. We know they were after something here. Since they decided to spare me, I mean us, let's be on our way. Let's make sure we're also healed. We are not. Now we continue to go left. <clears throat> From how far we've come, I'd say we're close to the Great Hall of the Lizard Clan. The sooner the better. After all that, even I'm tired. A bath, a nice bed, bread, I can't wait! Think the Lizard Clan has that for you? She'll find out soon enough. I wanted to see if we could get one more battle with some. Uh oh. Terra Knights and a flying pendulum thing. Let's maybe go for that. like his own little mini shredding. Oh, it hit that one too. Let's set this up. happy with that. And yeah, because he's mounted on Fubar, he doesn't get a little extra anim a animation. Okay, we're out. Ah, this is lovely. The sun feels divine. And fresh air. Only zombies could have lasted much longer in that tun tunnel. Sergeant, listen. Hmm? That sound. Blade against blade, and it's very near. We're too late again. Look at this. Those are sex and knights. The Iron Heads hit Pariah, and now they're after the Lizard Clan. 
This looks serious. You mean the Sexons look serious? But why now? Again? Again? Let's join the battle. You go. Come back. Don't leave me here, you fool. Yeah, of course, Hugo was gonna do a crazy amount. Bunch of metals and seas to replenish. Use one, get eight. <laughs> Iron heads. You can always count on them to be organized. I should hope so. Be careful. Sergeants. Oh. Let's not get carried away. We're here to show them the dignity of Zexan, not to exterminate them. Your actions have already overstepped those bounds. Looks like the White Maiden of the Knights wants bloodshed. What? Wait, Leo. I wasn't expecting to meet the Korean clan chief so soon after the treaty negotiations. I admire your coming forward personally once more. I couldn't resist seeing the pretty face of the Zex and my captain again. You have a treacherous tongue. And you, White Maiden, come with that treacherous sword that took lives from my clan. You hold that bloody sword of yours even now. If it's war you want... Your type of honorable war? Koreans do not think of a sneak attack massacre as being honorable, uh, war or honorable. As my ancestors did before me, I, the new lizard clan chief, take an oath of vengeance. The second knights will do their duty to protect their people. Made it this far, but there's too many iron hands for us to get through without a fight. <laughs> what is it? Look, both sides are withdrawing. Is our griffin to thank? Welcome back to Lizard Hollow.
Hugo. Hugo. Our Hugo is back. You all made it back. The attack on the village was awful. I can imagine you're shocked to find it reduced to ashes. Lucia, Lucia, come. Hugo is back. You were smart to come here. We tried to send word, but it just wasn't possible. At all. Spirits. No chance for that. And where is Lulu? That child always roaming about getting into trouble. Where is he? Were you separated? That child. As soon as he finds something new, he's gone like a bolt of lightning. I'll find him before dinner and reprimand him. I'm sure he's fine. If you made it back, he can't be too far behind. He will be showing up soon, won't he? Say it so. Say something, please. We are so sorry, Luce. I was there, and still he... I'm so sorry. Sergeant, you mean you lost track of him. That's what you mean, isn't it? We were there when the Karaya village was burned. That's when Lulu went after an iron head. We buried him on Karaya soil as soon as we could, with all the proper rites. Lulu. He watched as his own home burned. He must have thought he tried to get back at one of them, so with his knife he... Why did he have to do that? I managed to escape. Now I'm here and he is not. A knife so young. My poor child. Luce. I'm fine. I'm, I'm alright, Lucia. I'm not the only one who lost a child that day. I just didn't know. How is Luce? I gave her some team to calm down, then had her get some rest. Ah. Mother, I'm... I'm ashamed. At the village, when we got there, the sergeant stopped me from... I couldn't. Not one. Not even one iron head for Lulu. Later, the sergeant was furious with me. I wanted to fight so badly. Hugo, I know how you feel. Not just us. All the Grassland clans must fight if we are to survive. Harmonia from the north, Dunnan from the east, and Zexan. We fought for years to keep them all from taking this land. Nothing has changed yet, even though we fought with all our heart. In Grassland, we must fight to protect what is important. I shouldn't have listened to the sergeant. You must decide for yourself what is worth fighting for. Then you must fight for it with all your heart. But I will worry about you no matter what you choose to fight for. Consoling Luce, I tried not to show how happy I was you were alive. Any mother would feel that way. My love for you is strong, Hugo. I pray never to know that grief. I understand, mother. I know you do. You're a fine man, like your father. Hugo, are you... Oh. <laughs> what is it? Please, don't stop on my account, Hugo. I know you've been away from home. I know it's hard. Hmm. Who asked you? Did you want to talk? I hadn't seen those three from Tinto for a while, so I thought they might be with you. Ah, 
We can't let them make any trouble around here, especially that lily lady. Better go look for them. If they disappear, so will our other 2,000 potch. Sergeant, could you... Thank you. I don't intend to make that same mistake twice. Uh, how about we get a couple little training boys? That's just an item shop. Anything in the item shop that we could use? I mean, it's just the two guys right now. Rarity. No thanks. And those are just for lizards. I mean, Sergeant does have a tail. at the inn. Oh, hey. Anne. Oh, Hugo. Aren't you Hugo? Uh, Anne, glad you're safe and sound. Uh, after we got separated along the way, I finally managed to catch up. I could only bring what I could carry. Too bad. So, you lost your business? It's okay. I'll make do. I thought maybe I could find work here at the lodge. I see. There's no obligation just because we're friends, but if you could put in a good word for me, I'd be grateful. All right. Yeah. Let's get our bird boy back. Well, see ya. Right, she's a tavern keeper. Same girl. Seems she's been taken prisoner. Interesting. <clears throat> Beach up. You go, don't slack off during practice. It's just practice we're talking about. That's what. And this. If you can beat the area boss and the dungeon boss in the depths of the dungeon, it will polish your skills. What about polishing your knob? What? Okay, you go. You have some skills to learn. Continue to attack? Yes, yes, please. Big ol' counterattack. Man, this can this paired with continual attack will make him like just a demon. Hmm. Actually, let's invest in heavy damage. Fubar. Man, you need just tons of stuff. Let's keep that accuracy up, my man. Also, what other runes could you possibly equip? Must go faster. And yeah, one more repel. Sergeant Joe. Well, we could do heavy damage now, too. There we go. I like that. Swing up. <laughs> and let's go. Ah, uh, yeah, repel. That's good. I think you guys are going to be 
even more fearsome. That's where you want me to go, game. Also, we got serious amount of hush. Oh yeah, we did do all of that fitting in the deep underground. Well, let's also at least get stuff. Oh, here, yes, always buy. Crystal balls when you can. I think we could sell from here. Nope. <laughs> Tail better here. And then these. Good to pick up from here sell elsewhere <clears throat> okay that's fine let's go pick up Lillian crew and continue along there's no point in keeping secrets from me milady your talk insults the new clan chief Shiva Shiva this story may be good. Let's hear this, Doctor of the Tinto Chief. I'm not exactly a storyteller. I'm after the Firebringer. You must tell me whatever you know about them. Firebringer? That story is so very, very old. Firebringer? Perhaps you're unfamiliar with this because you're from the South. When I was young, I often asked my father to tell me about the great deeds of the hero Scott and the Firebringer. champion. The escort is small. Only one squad, an easy haul, will attack on my signal. Ready! Same as always, right? Same as always. There they are. Now! Over 50 years ago, more than half of Grassland was invaded by Har Holy Harmonian Kingdom. Most clans fell under their control, including ours. Even clans outside their grasp paid tribute. No one questioned this. Their army was unrivaled. Every clan combined was no match for just one Harmonian battalion. But the flame champion Scott and the Firebringer were unafraid. It's even more here than we expected. If it were like this every time, we could retire. Haha. <laughs> If only it were so. Leader, what shall we do with all these Richards? Riches. We will buy back Grassland. Brilliant, but why stop at Grassland? How about all of Harmonia? Right. <laughs> the grandest of schemes. Their battles were small, but word spread quickly about the Firebringer bandits who raided Harmonian transports. Those rumors made the clans brave and hopeful. Soon, one man led them all. At last, the showdown has come. So it has. This is it. The last battle. For good. Victory will be ours. Victory! Harmonian first forces clashed fiercely with the grassland forces led by Scott the Flame Champion. It was the worst battle in history. They say neither side was a clear victor. <laughs> what happened to the Flame Champion? 
No one really knows. He was never seen again. Even so, Harmonia has never tried to conquer Grassland again. No one's sure what really happened to him. Some say he went to the far western continent or died in valor. I've even heard he now lives a lavish life within Harmonia. That is why you must give up looking for the Flame Champion. So many tales have been told about the Firebringer returning, but they turn out to be fairy tales, nothing more. The events I speak of happened over 50 years ago. He'd be over 80 years old today, too old for most humans to live. If your quest is one of play, stop your folly and go home. this one we do. Oh, we already got stuff from him. <laughs> Actually, I want to check out this side here super quick. That's all fine for now. Also, are we waiting for it up? Uh, not really, but that's fine. Forgive me, thanks, but I'll be fine. At least you're safe. That's a relief. Tell us if there's anybody around here that looks sus. There's no reason to die young. Stay in hollow until the Iron Hands fully retreat. Oh, okay. Guess I'm supposed to do something else. Probably go to the inn. That's what my guess is. Please, you have found important clues. There is no need for anger. Who says I'm angry? And even if I was, there'd be no reason to treat me like a child. So it's true, you are angry. I beg your pardon. It's true, um, that... Now do you believe me? The Flame Champion is gone. Why do you insist on finding him? Why do you care? What I do is not your concern. Like Duba the clan chief and the sergeant both said, if he were alive, he'd be too old to be of any use to you. Ha! <laughs> huh, you have no idea, do you? You don't know why he's called Flame Champion, do you? Sure I know, who doesn't? Really? Fine then, tell me. Spare me your silly tales. Ha ha ha! Could have just said you don't know. Have you ever heard of the 27 true runes? Sure, my mother has talked about them many times. Runes? Ah, the ones with all kinds of untold powers. The flame champion possessed one, the true fire rune to be exact. And that's where flame came from, not too imaginative. Each of the 27 true runes has tremendous power. When I was young, I met someone gifted with such power. Shame I can't remember a thing about it. Anyway, all the true runes have one power in common. Immortality. One who uses a rune will never grow old. You're saying that... 
that the Flame Champion is young and alive and living somewhere in Grassland. He's using Firebringer too to attack Tinto Traders. Highly unbelievable. Instead of that nonsense, let's talk about something real. For instance, the 2,000 pots you still owe us. You're not much of a visionary, but that can't be helped. Read, pay them. Milady, there's a problem. What are you talking about? Our funds. Why weren't you more careful? At first, you said we would travel for one week. That was over a month ago. Put yourself in our position. It's always my fault. Lily is always to blame. She's the bad one, so it goes. I'm sorry, you'll have to wait a little long a while longer. Why? Our funds have run out. I can't pay anything unless I find a Tinto trader. I knew it. Duck, are you saying I lied from the start? Well, no, not exactly. What choice do I have? I can't pay you money I don't have. All that talk of being... Now you stop right there. Explain why you, what you meant. From with my credibility, speak up. What we're going to be doing with everybody is going to the uh, trainer and getting the rest of these goobs here some actual decent skills. <laughs> okay, let's see what people are actually good at. Swing, fairly good match. Swing damage or holy damage? Maybe swing so she can get in some more hits. Maybe. Guys are kind of clunking in it below average. Well, maybe we'll throw some magic on you in the future or something. Even though you don't even have a room slot open. Hmm. 
Samus coming again with big damage. Get up the end for now. Let's do a save. Ooh, because it's been a while since we saved. Almost an hour. Let's hit up the blacksmith one more time. Reza up. And his Skintilla. Cool. They're all now do crazy damage. <clears throat> and we'll head on out of here. Hopefully we can actually do that now. Look! Isn't that Jimba? Looks like it. Jimba, you made it! Wait a minute, didn't we just see him? Ah, Hugo, good to see you. You're looking strong as always. I gather you've seen the ruins of our village. I'm sorry to say I watched it burn. So it goes. Lulu, he's usually right at your heels. Where did he go? Lulu, at the village, he... Jimba, what happened is... It's quite a tale. You've been through a lot. I was gone from the village, too. When I returned, it was already in ashes. We must have missed each other somehow. From Chissa, I went by Lake Castle, then finally came here. Lake Castle? Tiny castle, if you can even call it that, which lies between Zexan and Grassland. Recently, a new lord took over the castle, and people from all over are coming to visit it. I thought I'd see what all the fuss was about, but I ran into a Zexan patrol and had to flee. Too bad, I really wanted to explore that castle. So it hasn't been an easy time for you e either. I should go and tell our clan chief I'm alive and tell her what I found. Can you take me to her? Okay, sure. Jimbo will join for now. What if I leave for half a second? Oh. Can't really go anywhere. Jimba, you're here. 
Yes, but it took some effort. I have much to tell you about Zexan, Harmonian Troop Movement, and the Flame Champion. The Flame Champion? You mean the old hero Scott? Believe it or not, yes. This conversation is not for every member of your clan to hear. Come, Hugo. Huh? Secrets are secrets. Not even official messengers should know. That's not fair. I deserve to know. Sergeant? What is it, boy? Is the flame champion Jimba spoke of the same one that... Probably, but why is someone like that girl interested all of a sudden? That's a puzzle. You're talking about me! Hey, don't scare me like that. Is Jimba the man who just walked by here? I'll be sure to ask him what he knows. Don't bother. Huh? It's you! Huh? Hugo, I must know. Did you do what I asked you to do? Of course. Thank you, Hugo. What a relief. You've been a great help. Um, people, are you ignoring me? You! Have you found out something about the Flame Champion? About this other matter. I believe the Second Knights have ulterior motives behind their attacks on the Great Hollow. Listen to me when I'm speaking. Listen! Jimba, did you hear something new about the Flame Champion in the past few days? Not about Scott the Flame Champion, but about what's left of the Firebringer he once led. Meanwhile, it seems Zexan may not have been the only one sending forces into Grassland. I want to list as many allies as possible in case the time ever comes. Finally, this is what I wanted to hear. I talked with our clan chief, and we agreed it's best to have you go to Lake Castle since I couldn't get in. Lake Castle? What for? To find the flame champion. Aren't you paying attention? People are coming from near and far to gather at that castle. It used to serve as a meeting place between Zexan and Grassland. It's no longer preposterous. Oh, it's no longer prosperous. The castle's new, new lord is like no other. He wants people from Gla Grassland to come. Alright, but how is that connected to the flame champion? The castle might also be a cover for the Firebringer. Go there and make contact with the castle lord, if possible, with the Firebringer themselves, okay? That's all there is to it. Leave this mission to me. So it's been decided that I can go? Yes, unless you're not interested. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I'm interested. Good. Once you're inside. If it doesn't seem safe to continue, learn what you, whatever you can, then get out. Summon the castle, watch the castle lord carefully, then make contact with any firebringer he may be sheltering. Could it be any easier? This is urgent, Hugo. Can you leave right away? Yes. Lake Castle, here we come. What? Are you coming too? Well, since you're inviting me, let's go. Soldier of Korean clan with a mysterious past. He assists clan chief Lucia along with Egypt. Samus, one of Lily's two attendants, is irritated by Lily's selfless wins, but ends up obeying them anyways. One of Lily's two attendants, his fate is always controlled by Lily's selfishness. The selfish, determined daughter of Gustav, chosen leader of Tinto. Regis and Samus are her attendants. Well, we might be off to Lake Castle one more time. Hugo, Sergeant, good luck. We won't need it this time. You be careful too, Jimba. Sure, sure. Why? What's he doing? Who can say? Don't give it another thought. My work here will be boring compared to yours. My lady, must we go to this castle straight away? 
Yes, members of the Firebringer are there. But if we go, we won't find a single Tinto trader to replenish our funds. What will we do at, at this castle? Don't question your duty. Now follow me. But across the center grassland, we may be thrown into combat at any moment. Those are the risks. Let's move it, people. Milady, wait. Doesn't she ever get tired? Turn to the left. No. Cool. That's the end of Hugo Chapter 2. I think we're going to call it there once again. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in as you did. Uh, if you're on the YouTube channel, make sure you're subscribed, like, thumbs up. Always leave me fun comments. I love reading them. And uh, we will catch you on the flip side.